Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. So today is July 13th, 2023. I almost said 2022. It's like, what the fuck? Where are the years going? I have no idea. It still feels like 2021 or two to me. It's like crazy. Anyways, I just woke up, made some coffee, and I wanted to start filming early. It's like seven in the morning right now. And I just made my coffee and I'm so excited because I got this new coffee creamer yesterday. It is this Chobani s'mores flavored coffee creamer. I've seen this for like a few months at the store. I just never bought it, but yesterday I did. And it's so fucking good. I just wanted to put y'all on really quick because holy fuck. Yesterday I got this package in the mail from Delta Munchies and they sent me a bunch of their two gram weed vapes. And I'm so excited because I've used these before. They sent me so many. Look at all these. So we got the OG Kush. We got the motherfucking LA Confidential, the Georgia Pie Hybrid, the Watermelon Gushers. I've tried this one before, it's really nice. Um, the Sativa, this is a Tangelo. Since I just woke up, I'm gonna start the day off with this Sativa Tangelo. And this is what they come in. You just open it up and you got the vape in here. Very nice packaging, cheers. Hell yeah. One thing about Delta Munchies vapes, they taste really good, they don't get stuck a lot, and they rip. I see my cat back here. He always wants his pets in the morning as soon as I wake up, he like runs to me. Good morning. Good morning, Mr. Man. Did you sleep good last night? Oh shit. So as you can see, I just made breakfast at the lake. And the reason I did this is because yesterday I was really wanting to go camping and like make hot dogs over a fire and come to this lake and just chill, but it got too dark out. So I was like, fuck it. For breakfast, we're gonna make some pancakes, some bacon in front of the lake. And I brought all my Delta Munchie vapes. So I'm gonna smoke on this and get fried today. I think what I'm gonna do is try to take 400 rips off of these today because I'm about to hit 400K subscribers. Um, which is crazy. I I can't even fathom that many fucking people watching my shit. So I just want to say thank you guys for 400k subs. I'm about like 2,000 subscribers away from it. So that's super dope. And it's just that's just insane to me. So thank you guys. I love you guys so much. And uh, this is for you. <laughs> So I'm back home now. I came back home, showered, cleaned up my apartment, and got it all organized in here. And it's almost one o'clock now, so I'm about to head to the grocery store to get things for dinner and just grab a few things that I need. I've also been ripping this bad boy. I fucking love how milky the hits and the ghost inhales are on this. It's so satisfying to hit. Hell yeah. So I'm in the grocery store right now and I'm getting things for dinner. I'm not gonna lie, that fucking dab pin really caught me off guard because I'm, I'm in this bitch high as fuck. So tonight I'm gonna to be making cowboy casserole. I have never made cowboy casserole. I kind of feel like a cowboy in this fucking shirt right now. I'm not gonna lie, so it's very fitting. But I found this recipe on Pinterest this morning and I was like, you know what, I'm gonna fucking make that because I wanna switch it up. I'm tired of making pasta and shit like that. And I got these. I'm so excited about these. Y'all know, y'all know how I feel about Texas Pete. I have went through probably like hundreds of bottles of Texas Pete in my lifetime. It's like, it goes on everything for me. And when I cook popcorn normally, I put it on it like, with like, I usually put like Hershey drops in my popcorn and hot sauce. And it's like so good, it's crazy. But I saw this and I was like, yeah, this is like made for me. Oh my God, every time I open popcorn, I literally fuck up so hard and end up opening the whole damn thing. Like, why do I do that? Mm. This is actually really good. 
<laughs> Alright you guys, so it's a cowboy cast real time. I'm going to go ahead and get to cooking dinner. So I'm going to start by frying up my bacon and my hamburger meat. And then I'm going to get my base ingredients started. So you're going to need cream of mushroom soup, sour cream, and milk. Let that cook down. And then once your meat's done, you're going to want to add all that into the same pan and mix it together real good. And then add in some cheese. I put a cup of cheese in here. And then I also threw in a cup of corn to really give it the cowboy effect. You can also put jalapenos in. I know at this point it looks pretty disgusting. <laughs> it looks like cat vomit. But once you top it with your tater tots and let it cook for about 45 minutes, it's going to be really nice and crispy. Take it out, put more cheese on top, and throw it back in the oven so it gets really nice and cheesy and toasty and shit. Y'all look at that. This looks so fun. Fire. Oh my god. Wow. This is definitely a, like a comfort meal. It's very hearty and fulfilling, you know? I'm gonna try to take a rip off of each of these and then see how fucked up I get. Off of the rips that I just took, I can definitely feel fucking high. And it's like all in my eyes and my head and my body. I just feel like really fucking relaxed. Whoa, that definitely smacked me. Holy shit, there's so many flavors in my mouth from that. Damn. <coughs> so I have a funny story to share with you guys that happened to me earlier. <coughs> So after I got out of my shower, I was looking out of this window. I have you guys sitting in my like kitchen window. And from here, we can I can see down at the street and there's like a parking lot, like a one parking spot um, for the apartment below, you know? Cause there's like my apartment and there's one like down there I can see. Anyways, these new people are moving in today. Uh, my new neighbors. And I was standing here I was like doing the dishes, so I only had my underwear on. And I had like the blinds down pretty much, but there was just enough blinds open to where you could like, I didn't know they were moving in today. My I add. I look, I walked by, there was probably about this much window open, which is a lot. And I, they were just like carrying stuff in and I just kind of stopped for a second. And I was forgetting that I was standing here in my underwear and I looked down at them and I made direct eye contact, bitch. And I was just so embarrassed because I probably look fucking crazy. Like these people are moving in their new home. They look up at me because like my apartment's on the top and there's like one down there. They see me just staring down in my underwear. And I look crazy as it is. So you know what I mean? Like fuck. All right. I think I'm going to go play some video games now. I have recently started playing Apex Legends, you guys. And it's actually fun as fuck. I've been a Fortnite guy since like 2017. And I've always, I've tried Apex like a handful of times uh, since it came out and got popular, but I never liked it. I always hated it. I was like, fuck that game. Recently, I got bored of Fortnite and got bored of COD, so I got on it and I've been kicking ass and I've been having a fun time. So I'm going to go play a, a game of Apex and get my ass kicked, but hopefully do good. Bro, I'm just like going fucking crazy. What the? Oh, that's what's up. Oh no, fuck. Okay guys, so it's a little bit later. I don't know if you can tell by my eyes, but I'm pretty fucked. <laughs> it's like 11 at night and I, I'm really high. I was gonna try to do a 400 hits of the weed debate for today's video of these. I don't even know how many hits I've taken. I've taken a lot of fucking hits, but fuck. I'm just gonna take some more to end the night. Like I said, it's like 11 o'clock. God damn.
Holy shit. The amount of smoke these things produce is like absolutely insane. Oh my god. I'm way too fried to continue this video, you guys. Like, <coughs> holy shit. My eyes are extremely fucking red. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay, I'm gonna take. Back there is not real. Raggy.